Once upon a time, in a faraway land, there lived a daring young zoologist who entered a cave full of mystery and discovered an incredibly new dragon species. Or that can be the tale, because this is Become a Dragonologist program. It's with Arlington Public Libraries Summer Reading Club. Imagine your story. So that's what we're doing today. Hi, everybody. Welcome, fearless adventurers. I have with me some handy sheets that we're going to be giving out. But you know what? If you don't have a printer at home, it's no big deal. We can still do these, this program together. So become a dragonologist. And here we go, we're gonna do this program all together. So pretend you are a zoologist. Now, zoology is the study of animal life. So that's what you get to pretend to be. And you're going along in this magical land and you come across this amazing cave. You enter into it and you discover this amazing dragon species. Now, as a zoologist, it's your responsibility to create a record of facts. So we provide this as an example, and you'll see on the sheet, it mentions taxonomy. And taxonomy is a classification system of things like plants and animals. And if you have no idea what that is, and you would like to know more about it, find a nearby friend or a family member, and you, they can be your assistant, and you can go online and learn all about that you can practice your research skills. But anyway, just remember that it's your dragon. So knowing a lot more about taxonomy is great, but it's still your dragon, so you can create whatever words that you like for your dragon species, which is pretty fun. So look at all the different facts and fill out that form. It's things like full length of body and length of tail and so forth. All right, so you gotta know everything that is particular about your dragon species. So, done with that. Next is to draw your dragon species. What does it look like? Oh my goodness, and you can use anything you like. You can lose a pencil, use, not lose. You can use a pencil. You can use paint. You could use a tempera stick. You can use crayons, markers, anything you like. So then you'll draw your dragon species or color your dragon species. And then the last part of your record is my favorite part. It is the journal account. And this is fun because we need to know how it came about. How did you find your dragon species? This is all very important stuff. So you need to share your story about how, as a zoologist, you discovered this dragon. And after that, you are done. You created a wonderful account ready for the Zoological Society of Fantastical Creatures, and I know that they will be so excited to have it in their encyclopedia of fantastic creatures. Adventure awaits. <laughs>